So a quick uh, check check. We should be good here, I believe. I should actually get my headphones on so that I can verify before I just start talking out of my butt. Are we good? Are we good? That's not, it's not actually plugged in. Fuck. Can I hear myself? Yay. Testing. Yay. Okay, we should be we should be just about good to go here. Yay, yay, I think we're yay. I think we might be yay. I need the booze to be yay. I'm gonna get the booze. Are we ready? I am. I arf. I arf. Ah, I the punned it. Is to cheer up Master Con with extreme cuteness. I did the pun. Yay. Hi, Poppy. How's it going? Bam. No, that's the wrong. Bam. There we go. Are we good? Okay. Real question. I'm going to have to ask once we actually get in and going if everything is properly synced up in terms of audio because I had to do a lot of futzing around with stuff to get it working with Juker for No More Heroes last night and I'm not sure if I properly reset everything. <laughs> Hello, Isaac. Hi, Princess. Licensed by Nintendo, the Capicom, the Creeware. Of 
Where's my remote? Right here. Okay, continue. Did no more heroes or did Juker? I was doing it. Yeah, we're getting started on uh on the new series for uh for la for our, my YouTube channel. Because we've already done the first one, it's already all up on uh, on my on my channel. Link is below the stream. But we're starting the second one, and we got through the first episode, and then the disc screwed up. So I got that repaired today. We should be able to continue recording soon. Yeah. Need to be synced up. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna ask for like a couple of checks here. So there's me, there's my voice. Hello, is my voice synced up to the webcam? Yay nay. Second test, is game audio synced up uh to to the game video? I will bork to test the timing. Everything sound good? Game seems good, you seem good. Awesome, fantastic. Okay, let's continue being a holy doggo. What was it that I needed to do? I think we got to a point where we needed to go out to the ghost ship, right? That's the last thing? Because we had to go after the fox rods, if I'm remembering last week correctly. Good lord, I also need about 18 times more of these than I have because it has been an exhausting week, week and a half of not really much time to just... and regain myself. <sighs> Even these streams, while fun and keeping me, uh, you know, like on a schedule and playing good games and socializing with you guys, this isn't really veg time for me. I have to be on, as it were, <laughs> for these. So, here's hoping that in the upcoming week or two, I will be able to just carve out an Thanks, afternoon Mom. or a day where I'm not doing anything. Thanks, Mom, for keeping me so goddamn busy. Exactly. Oh, damn it. Everything is it's loading on top. I'm sorry. Thank you, AMZ John, for the nine bits. I saw that. Where's the Twitch alerts? Twitch alerts, you need to get back up closer towards the top. There we go. No has been driving me crazy. I'd like to hang out with my GF, but the weather's been screwing that up. I completely understand that. I hear you on that front. Okay. Oh my good Romeo, say give me some new ship parts. What? Why do you need ship parts? Oh god, why am I in the water? Oh, I ran into the water when I wasn't looking. Um, okay, so... He said something about needing a new moon. Right? Is a new moon the one where, uh, it's... Like, no moon in the sky whatsoever? Because it kind of looks like it might be tonight... So where's the place where I have to go? Is there a journal of some kind in here? Useful info. Logbook. Journal. Fox rods. The queen finally managed to locate. We had fox rods. We could drive out evil beings. Sunken treasure. Let's go to the treasure ship. We must wait until the new moon rises in the night sky. In the shallows where the ship ran aground, called the Lunar Lagoon, the tide only recedes when the new moon is seen from the moon turret. Okay, so I have to get to the moon turret. Gotcha. Let's go. I hope I can make it there before daytime comes, because if not, I might be waiting a while for it to become night again. This is the moon turret. Yeah, it's it's right next to the ship. This has got to be it. 
Also, how does a new moon rise in the night sky? A new moon is when there's nothing there. What's up with you? You want to climb up this? Well, you learned that move, didn't you? Just jump with everything you got. Bam. There we go. Crescent moon? What a nice view. Too bad it's spoiled by that sunken ship. Sorry looking thing. What's that strange pattern on the bottom of the sea? It looks like a huge crescent moon or something. Shaped too perfectly to be a coral reef. What was it the busty babe said? Something about the moon turret. Wonder if she meant this thing. What was it she said? Hmm. So is a new moon the the one where it's not there, or is it the full moon? I, I think it's the one where it's not there at all. And I don't see it here. I wonder if it's some sort of hint. I mean, I, I could try just drawing this in the sky. Come on. No, now it's daytime. Son of a bitch, I missed it. Yeah, it, it looks like that's exactly what it wants me to do. Oh, a new moon might be... Yeah, it, it might be the crescent that I'm able to draw. Because uh, it needs to be like just when the moon is just starting. Oh, you're playing Phantom Hourglass for ship parts, gotcha. So. Yeah, like, it's it's just not drawing. There we go. Okay, new moon. I hope. Look down. Ooh. Okay, so it is the one that I could do with my paintbrush. Good, good, that's good to know. And now everything just washes away. That's not something you see every day. Wonder if it's safe to walk up there. Ah, it should be. Let's go! Oh god, ah! <laughs> okay, bam. And now we will And perfect. Whoop. Okay. Busty babe. Ray, where are you at? Are you down here? I suppose I should dig up this first. Dig, 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 dig. Oh, it's a clam. I, no, the, the clams are just treasure chests. Yeah, all right. Ex ah, nah, it's exorcism slip. I don't really care too much about that. I'm going to look around really quick because... I don't imagine, well, I mean, I can technically get into this almost any time that I want, but I'm here now. So let's look around a bit. There's probably not going to be a ton to find. Dig, dig, dig. There's another thing with, uh, I, I, okay, I guess that gives me godness to max. That's the thing that gives me, like, four free hits. That's not bad. And I think we actually end up meeting Ray inside. I think it was Ray. Might have been Ra. Ra something? There we go. That's an actual treasure I can sell, make some money on. Sunken ship. Hmm. That door looks cursed. They probably sealed it up like that to keep looters out. But I've never seen such a sinister looking curse before. I sure hope this whole ship isn't one big curse. Any rate, this puppy ain't gonna be easy to dispel. Wow, that was it. Amaterasu. Hello! What a wonderful run. <laughs> 
busty babe. You're here already, both of you. I'm sorry I'm late. My political duties delayed me. This is the treasure ship you were talking about, babe. Yes, this is where the fox rods Queen Himiko was looking for are. It was sunk by the water dragon, and now it's filled with monsters. My holy powers can easily deal with a few dozen monsters. There's nothing to worry about. Let's go in. That's all fine and dandy, babe, but uh, what about this cursed door here? Was it sealed up like that to keep looters out? Or maybe it's the curse of those who died when the water dragon sunk their ship. That thing's just seething with an intensely evil power. Oh, so there's a cursed door to stop anyone from getting through. I see. That's a neat trick. You got that right. We better find another way in. Oh, cool. Well, she's she's brought her her sex music with her. <laughs> this time we join forces, Amaterasu. There will be more barriers sealed by magic as we get further inside. We come to them. I'll use a prayer slip to break the seal. So, if you don't mind. Oh, wonderful! She's gonna ride me for a while. <laughs> Oh, it's Isun's dream. Handling prayer slips is my affair, but I would like your assistance in targeting. Don't worry, what I ask is not difficult. You know how to manipulate the brush of the gods? Use that power to guide the prayer slip. Let's practice on the curse barring the door. Bam, bam. Fantastic. As long as I have my slips, there's nothing to be afraid of. Not even monsters. Great treasure awaits. Let's go find the fox rods. Woo! All right. Now we've got a priestess. <laughs> it's not that long, thankfully. No, don't tell her that, Isaac. You're gonna scare her off. <laughs> Ami's been influenced by Isun. I don't know if it's necessarily that she's become a pervert. I think it might just be that, you know, she's amazed by amazing things, and Rao has amazing things to share with us. Her powers, obviously. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. Okay, let's go. Oh, right, shoot. Okay, we, we can't fight these guys. We have to actually do this to them. I think, right? Yes. Funny that they don't, um, they don't stop when I'm inside the brush powers. They're, like, somehow immune to it or outside of that time pause. Excuse me. Just look at those treasure chests. <laughs> We're gonna be millionaires even before we find them fox rods. Fox, fox, fox rods. That's what I meant. I no, I I didn't say fox rods. I I didn't. You didn't hear me say it except for right there. But you you didn't. I didn't say it. You can't prove nothing. <laughs> We're gonna be rich. Celestial envoy. I think by stealing them all, I actually... What are those flowers? Did I just spawn flowers on top of Rao? I think that's what's a that's what accidentally happened. I just did it again! <laughs> I can make a flower on her head. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, 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 my goodness. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. Please don't, please don't get up in my camera like that. I don't, I don't like you. I don't like you, big ghostly spider woman head. 
You're spooky. Hmm. So where to go first? Oh well, that that's that's unfortunate. Can I can I just can I bam? There we go. So I'm definitely gonna have to go down all of these skull roots, I believe. Whoops! Shit. Let's just start off with this one. Watch your head there, Rat. My butt's on fire! Why is my butt on fire? Somebody put out that fire butt! <laughs> Oh, wonderful. Big old pile of bones. Oh, they're cute little crabs! I wonder what they're weak to. Oh, okay, so he has a shark on his backside. There's nothing that immediately reads is, like, clear to me about that. Bomb doesn't do anything. The other one has... Oh, oh, they both have half of a shark. That's interesting. I am completely unaware as to how you want me to, uh, to do this. I don't see any fire for me to work with. I don't see any water. Wind didn't work. Blooming them doesn't seem to do anything. Because there's nothing to bloom. I tried a bomb on the other one. Bomb on you also doesn't do anything. Yeah, the wind's still... I'm almost out of health, and I'm almost out of ink. Flowers don't work. Scribbles don't work. What all do I have? Inferno, Gale Storm, the Moon, Water Spout, the Vine, Water Lily, Bloom, Cherry Bomb, Power Slash, Rejuvenation, and Sunrise. Yeah, there's really nothing in here that seems like it would work. Later, Servant Princess. I'm sorry that you could only stick around for like 15 minutes. <laughs> Why are they climbing this? Oh? That, that's weird. They like busted the top off it. Oh, I wonder what that means. Oh right, I have prayer slips, dummy. That also did nothing. And that's my first death, huh? I guess we can f start filling up the astral pouch again. Hit them hard. Oh, right, I have this. So I just have to keep bashing on them, is that it? I need you to stop. Okay, okay. Just gotta bash off their, uh, their protection. So both a Power Slash and a Cherry Bomb didn't seem to do anything for them, but they're down now. Oh, okay, no, they, they weren't, they weren't really clearing the bone pile. They just kept knocking that top bit off. Well, I've lost my first life to crabs. It's truly unfortunate. 
uh, that those had to come about as soon as you joined us, Rao. I swear, cra I don't... There, I don't usually have crabs as a problem that I have to deal with. I promise this is this is outside of the norm. Next time we meet, I'll have those taken care of. Uh, this is, this is an awful first date. Uh, fuck. I'm blowing it. I'm blowing it, guys. Isn't it beautiful? Even a ship doomed by the water dragon can enjoy the starlight. But it only looks like this inside the ship when there's a new moon. As soon as the sun comes up, cold sea water floods the ship again. Yes, the ship has suffered a cruel fate. So, what you're saying is that I can use my sun and moon powers to control the water level. Which I can use for the powers of puzzle solving. Oh, come on. Come on. Ah, that's not much of a flood. It's impossible. It can't be daybreak yet. Surely this can't be. You didn't do this, did you, Amaterasu? Powers can control the very movement of the heavens. That they can. I can control the movement of a lot else if you'll, uh... Give me some one-on-one -on -one time to show you. Isu, get out of here. Me and Rao need some girl time. <laughs> I apologize for nothing. Okay, good, good. It's not that much of a flood, either. Whoops. No, not the crabs again. Oh, stop. Stop. Okay, you're not crabs anymore. You are a giant shark. Well, um, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is like a mini boss, isn't it? Well, now I have water that I have to worry about, too. Ah! Great, they stick around. He appears to be stuck behind a barrel. Fuck. I ruined the thing he was stuck behind. Oh, God. Oh, God. Awesome. And got him. So a cut was not his fang thing, but he was big and scary, so I'm okay with not necessarily digging up the demon fang. Just happy to win. Yeah, how would you go about one-shotting that dude? He had a bunch of health. Maybe if, it, maybe if you found, like, a perfect weakness of his or something... Okay, so I don't see anything else available here to go up, but I can definitely go this way. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. No. Oh, okay, whoops, uh, uh, um, I'm all good. Okay, okay, so that was just a sun spot so that I could flood the entire room. Which I guess I needed to do to get back up to the top of there. But I can also go through there now. Let's check out this one first. Uh, 
Okay, so this, the water actually has to be down for me to go through there. Gotcha. Then back of this way. A cannon and a key door. Okay. Gotta do some thinking here. Gold dust full charge glaive hit. Mm, okay. Yeah, I suppose if it wasn't on the Wii and the glaive is easier to use, I could I could see that. So I'm going to have to aim this thing up and down to hit those various points. But I don't believe I can really load anything into it while the water's up. Oh, I can. Huh. Okay, cool. So that's one. How would I go about... Aiming it down. Oh, it's just for bonuses. Okay. I mean, the fucking... I'll take bonuses. There was a chest up there. Ooh! A piece of a sun fragment. That's handy. More life! Yay! I'm gonna go ahead and guess that I can't can't just power slice those. I'm gonna have to aim the thing down. Somehow. I drew a cherry bomb inside the thing somehow, but it didn't explode it, so cool definitely needs to interact with the cannon. Oh? Oh? Is it really that simple? Holy shit! It might be that simple. I did it! I blew up all the things! Yay! There's the key! Huzzah! And I did all this before I even sank the water. Boop! Um, yeah, and I can't get the key, so, so I definitely can't get that one until the water's down. But I can only get over here when the water's up, so there must be another way to to lower and raise it off down this hallway. Oh, bang, bang, thank you. Damn, look at them all. Thinking they hot shit. Wham, bam, bam. Wonderful. Okay, cool. So what else are we looking at? Yo, doing okay back there, Rao? I'm doing an awful lot of flipping. You sure you're not getting, uh, getting wolf sick? It's what I call the sensation. Similar to seasickness, except when you're on the back of a wolf that is constantly somersaulting. Oh, God. Oh, boy. That... That shouldn't be... Um, ah, okay. I don't, I don't know what that was. 
or how I spawned it, or further what that is. Just gonna sneak on up. Oh god. Okay. There's some sort of giant slug monster here. Oh, it's terribly ugly. This looks gross. Ugh. Can I drop a bomb on it or something? Make it go away? Well, I certainly can, but I don't think that's gonna do much. <laughs> oh god, okay, 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 it's just a hand. I was worried the whole face was coming up to say hi. Hmm. No thanks, no thanks. Get those away from me, please. Is this some kind of a sea giant? Why is it here? I want to get that chest, but I also don't want to put myself in the water with it. So I think I'm going to pass that one by for the time being. Ah, yes, there is. Okay, so here's where I can do the, uh, the sun thing. Oh, this is the same room. Wait, what? So how am I supposed to get in there then? I came all the way around. Okay, so I guess I used the cannon, so I did something while the water was up. Now I need to lower it again. There was that one path that I didn't take yet. I'm really curious as to how to get this thing to move up. Because I know that there's got to be a way... Thought. Because I definitely see water under here but I can't access it. I was going to see if I could water spout it up, but it doesn't look like that's going to work. That thing's huge. Looks like a humongous balance scale or something. Wonder what it was used for. It's only got weight on one side. So I need to hook something else onto it on that side to pull up. Okay. And I bet it'll go halfway so that I can use this as a stair. Gotcha. Okay. Rao is not a thought. What is a thought, by the way? I have an idea as to what it is, I just don't think she fits the definition. Ow! around calling people thoughts if you don't even know what it is. I guess no, that that was Isaac that said beats me. That's fair. Oh. Fuck, this was just the entrance. Damn it. So I got completely turned around as to where we actually were in all this. Cannot get up there unless the water's up. 
I bet I wasn't supposed to jump down. Give me a sec. I'm going to have to go back. Uh, make, make the lap around the ship one more time. I'll get there. I'll get there. wish it wasn't such a pain to navigate this area when it's all covered in water. I just want to run. Just let me run. Give me, like, water walking abilities or something. Okay, that's that. Then we hop over here. We get up to there, good. Cannon's done its thing entirely. We just have to get through here and then get back to the room where we can make it night, lower the water. And hopefully I can do that without having to hop down. Here comes the slug monster again. If I make a break for it, I should be able to get through this room pretty quick. Whoops. Okay. So it saves the point where it was at before. That's good to know. Maybe I have to jump down there? I'm, one, like, I'm wondering now what I could hook that up to. It can't be the slug monster. Oh, okay, okay. Didn't catch that before. You hop down like that. Oh, I thought that was going to be a sort of a ramp. That it would just sort of whoop, swing it over there. Not so. Okay. So, what's the next step then? Got the thing there. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, yay. Oh, okay. Wonderful that I have to walk in the water with the slug monster, but this appears to be the one who wants to. Oh god, oh, it's right there. Oh, it's right. Get it away. Get it away. I don't want to be here. Yeah. Okay, great, great. Open up this since it's a safe spot. Time for circus Ami. Ami is just proving herself to be like made for the circus now. What are those? Spiky ones. Where is the sluggo? Where is he? I don't I don't see him anymore. This makes me very uncomfortable. I, I can't get a clear shot of the sky from back here. Fuck. Oh, wow, okay, I looked away and now you're there. Um So, do I have to cross the room with that thing there? I really don't want to do that. It's so hideous. Like, I feel like those things have to serve some purpose, but I bet I'm not going to know what it is until the water's lowered. And there's no leaf or nothing for me to get to the other side. And that's too high to jump. Mm, 
Okay. Uh, oh, I see. It was just, uh, just a clipping distance thing. And he is not slow either. Like, if I get in the water, I get the sense that he's going to block my path pretty damn effectively. Do you think people ever get concerned about the constant switching between day and night? Probably. Possibly. Um, but you know what? I'm I'm a god, so I'm allowed to do whatever the fuck I want, basically. Okay. He's not going any farther than that. I might have an option. No, I don't because it's not a water spout. So I, so I can't I can't make the thing that just goes straight up out of the water. Fuck, I thought that was going to be my way out. I don't want to touch it. I don't want to go anywhere near it. <laughs> But they got me to this point clearly for a reason. Cool, that doesn't do anything. Like, I had to set that down. That was just mandatory. It had to happen. Bomb doesn't do anything for the weight of it. I can't water spout it. I can't fire or nothing. It's weird that they're glowing gold, but I don't think that specifically means something. Fuck. Arr, yeah, I might, I'm just going to have to make a run for it. Ugh. Ugh. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! No, thank you! Let's continue moving away from there now, please, thanks. Oh god. Yeet. Ooh, ooh, okay, okay, okay. That made me very uncomfortable. <laughs> this is the most disgrossing enemy I've seen in the whole game so far. Orochi got nothing on this thing. <laughs> You're reacting the way I react to tornadoes in Wind Waker. I will not use Rao as a sacrifice. Are you kidding me? She's a holy priestess. She's absolutely critical and necessary to the well-being of this land. For multiple reasons. I can think of at least two. There we go. Now I can get up there. While well, it's nighttime. Bam. Is the seaweed monster still here? He is, but he's weirdly just like me, 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 he's stuck. So I am going to crush him. Ow. Crush him. Ow. Crush him. Me, 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 me,
It's so good. Ugh. Time for the other one. Here comes a big old spike barrel. Oh god, oh god. Don't touch it, don't touch it. You big spike barrel. I got praise for that. The rest of the village didn't even know this thing was here, and yet they can feel that an evil has been lifted. <laughs> ah, so good. Okay, cool. And now we can run in here. Grab the this. Now. You think you hot shit there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Locke? Well, I got news for you. You ain't. Here comes a key. Gonna stab you right in your... Right in the eye. You got praise for murdering. What exactly gave you the praise? The local populace, who understood, just like on an instinctual level, that uh, something terrible has been removed from this world. <laughs> Oh god, oh, oh god. Oh, that would be uh, the crimson skull head thing. I would love it if you would stop obscuring my camera right now. It's showing me the souls of bosses I've defeated. Because it showed the spider lady for- will you get out of here? You obtained Lucky Mallet. What is this? Finally, something interesting. Wait, this is a Lucky Mallet. Is this what you were looking for, babe? It can shrimp people down until they become so small that they can pass through the eye of a needle. Certainly a tool with such powers is a great treasure. But it doesn't provide an answer to Queen Himiko's prayers for peace. Someone else mentioned an eye of a needle lately. Oh yeah, it was that half-baked prophet Waka back in Sing Seai City. Remember, he said something like, even the most solid defense has a tiny gap like the eye of a needle, and then then he farted it and wafted it in my direction. Then you didn't move away, and so I was hit with the full brunt of it, and I'm like, oh, Abby, oh, God, why didn't you move away? You must be suffering from this worse than I am. You got the scent of a of a dog, literally. Then you, you I, feel, I feel like you just wanted to do that just to punish me. What kind of God are you, Abby? Anyway, what kind of place are you talking about? It seems what I was looking for isn't on this ship. Unfortunately, we must leave without it. Aw, oh, cheer up, babe. The ocean's a big place. You'll find what you want somewhere. Maybe so, but going into the ocean now is suicide. As long as the water dragon's still about. Nobody can shut up about that thing. You think the water dragon ruled Ryoshima Coast or something? Well, don't forget we have Boss Ami with us. Let's go think things back in the city. Think over things back in the city. I'm tired of this ship. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, I feel like this is a very poor situation to be momentarily stuck in. We're just gonna go like that. Fuck. It didn't work. Bam. Bam. No, I said... I said bam. There we go. Oh, I'm still on fire. Son of a bitch. Um, I believe that will get sorted out in time as I just find more solar units. So I don't need to worry too much about it. How'd that animation contract turn out? It went well! And now I'm done it, and I'm waiting for uh, final rendered images to be delivered to me. And we done. Ami can't swim like that. I can't swim like that as her. Mm -hmm. Can't you swim any faster, Amaterasu? Eh? I mean, what do you expect, babe? Ami's a wolf, not a speedboat. Oh, I get it. You want to go to the bathroom, right? <laughs> No, Isun, that's that's not it. <laughs> we don't mind. Isun! Christ's sake! 
And there's nothing but wide open sea all around. Nobody's looking. Hey, soon. Go ahead, that's what everyone does. You, stop it, right now. You don't understand. The swelling of the waves is a sign that it's coming. We'll be helpless if we're attacked here. Here we go again. It is actually on its way. If it is that water dragon, was it? If it is... We'll take care of the beast in a jiffy. It'll regret the day it messed with us. That Isun, that is not a thing to trifle with. What the? Oh boy. It also wants Rao. Where'd that thing come from? Okay, so you can just hop across the water. Why are you even waiting on us? Is that the water dragon? Yes. Yes, it is. It's certainly not your Aunt May. Look out! Oh, do I, do I actually have... Oh, God, I actually have to do things. Why are we in such open sea? This is not anywhere near... Like, the, the shore was like... Look, look at that! We went from there to the ship. What direction was Ami going in? Why am I way the hell over here? Oh boy, um, I'm guessing I have to just get back to coast, right? I got eaten, even though I was nowhere near the thing. Huh? Where are we? We're not... Oh, cruel world, I'm too young and handsome to die! Yeah, and second thought, maybe we just washed up on the shore. Did you see what attacked us? It was huge! What the heck was it? Nobody told me something like that was on the loose around here. What's with the busty babe? She just took off without us! I'm gonna give her a piece of my mind next time we meet. This mallet just jumped out by itself! I hate to see treasure run off like that after an army. Well, no, I'm, I'm actually going to go this way. I want to stop in at the dojo. I think I got monies for something. I can't swim and this makes me anxious. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I can see that. <laughs> oh, the double jump is so nice. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's at Rao's temple here. But I can jump over the walls, I believe, now that I have the double jump. Sweet double jump. <coughs> I am going in the completely wrong direction, actually, because the dojo was closer to the city. I apologize. I thought Rouse Temple was the dojo. That's my fuck up. I can't survive being eaten by a giant sea serpent, so it makes me anxious. Also valid reason. <laughs> That's true. Rao left us for dead. She hopped right on out of there and proved she didn't need us. What do you got? Nothing good. Okay. Oh, wait, but I can sell something. Bam, 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 bam. Just clear out. Clear out everything. Give me that sweet, sweet moons. Awesome. I am back up to 100,000. <sighs> Excuse me. Well, that didn't work. Can I get out on this side? No, I need a water lily. All right. Bam. There we go. Is there anything else I can afford? I think there was something here for me. Right, the extra combo. Oh, the Golden Fury, right! I can insult foes and get Demon Fangs the easy way. Bam. Oh, 
Let's do the thing where we pee on people. I'm sorry, did I spoil it? This is exactly what this move is. You pee on people. Let the lesson begin! Take this tips! Golden Fury. During battle, press the C button to insult the enemy. Doing so will cause your foe to drop a demon fang. Do you understand? Let's go. But granted this technique, scroll. Since obviously, as a goddess, you don't know how us mortals pee. Now train your pee muscles. Train them. There we go. <laughs> I got it. I can pee. <laughs> I can combo infinitely with pee. <laughs> Look at that. That's 30 P's. 30 P points. <laughs> Wonderful. The Celestial Pisser. <sighs> I'm still trying to work towards that Shantae Lude emote. Because I'm thinking about emotes right now. Uh, I just haven't had time this week. With the No More Heroes thing that we tried yesterday and then repairing it today. I've got a bunch of references that I want to use for it. It's just a matter of sitting down and drawing the thing. Once I find time to do it, it shouldn't take me more than a couple hours. So within a couple weeks, I think. I'm, I'm, ah, fuck, I'm sorry it's taking me so long. I might need suggestions for another one to use after Shantae Lude, though. Because I believe I might have had enough subs at one point to get the next rank up. So if you guys have any suggestions, hit up my Discord and drop them in the suggestions box. Ryoshima Coast is not the best song in anything ever. I will fight you on that. It's a good track. Not the best ever. Where did you find these references? Uh, on the Twitch um, tool. Like, th there's a tool that can allow you to search for all of the Twitch emotes, like, in existence. Uh, for things that are, like, an exact image match, or you can search for them by word. So, if you use that tool and look for the word uh, lewd or gasm, you just get all of everybody else's lewd emotes. So, I can use those as a reference for something to draw. Right, I actually need to go out the back of Rao's temple. Has anyone told you to make a Poppy emote? Okay, so that's an option. Because I already have this one, just for me. I could free this one up for, uh, for, for like, public use. And then just make another special one for me for the, uh, for the 10 level. Thank goodness you're safe, Amaterasu. Hey, babe, what are you doing here? And how come you didn't tell us about that monster? I'm sure I mentioned something about the water dragon, didn't I? Ah, whatever. You better not be trying to trick us. What are you talking about? I was nearly eaten alive, too. However did you get away? You are a rather slow swimmer. What did you just say? Take that back. Amy gets kind of sensitive about her flaws. Sorry. The fox rods. If they're not on that ship, then where on earth are they? If they're lost in the sea, the vast realm of the water dragon, there's no way we'll ever find them. Ah, oh, cheer up. I hate to see you and your two friends cry. Ah, oh, damn it, Ami. I mean, you soon. Fuck. <laughs> well, the bouncing mallet still wants to take us on an adventure. In this direction, where the miasma seems to be coming from. Now we got you cornered, you, 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 you mallet. No treasures ever escape from the Great Eastern. 
I'm gonna sell you to some greedy merchant and uh, wait, wait, wait. Check it out, Ami. Isn't this the place where that swirling mist is coming from? You made us chase you here for a reason, Mallet? Wait, I think I get it. The lucky Mallet can shrink people, right? You wanna shrink Ami here? Then you want us to go into that creepy looking hole, don't you? I don't know. Why would Hammerhead here want us to go in there? Still, it might be worth checking out, Ami. I mean, this palace has got to be the source of that mist. If Queen Amiko's not going to do anything about this mess, then it's up to us to find out the truth. Anyway, we haven't found a single brush technique in this darn city. How could we possibly pass up the palace? Okay, mallet. We'll enter the hole. Come on and work your magic on Furball here. Ready to get hammered, Ami? I sure am. Bring it. That's what I wanted to hear. Pound me into that hole, Mallet. Pound me. Two? Three? No, there wasn't much of a pounding going on. It was actually rather gentle. Oh, okay. okay. Well, the shoving happened, at least. Now I'm a tiny wolf. <laughs> you should see the look on your face. A few shakes of a lucky mallet reduces things to my size. It's not for crawlburn people or anything silly. Boy, I'll never get tired of messing with your head. It's Isun! In an actual size where we can see him. <laughs> eh? What's going on in here? You forgot what I looked like already? Now you listen here and you listen good, Furball. You better remember me this time, or else. I'm Isun the Wandering Artist, you got it? Alright, that's it's kind, of a, kind of a cool intro shot. Besides, I'm so dashingly handsome, who else could it be? Bet you see me in a new light now, eh? Eh? She's looking at literally anything else. <laughs> I'm talking to you. She's like, what's that over there? Forget it. Let's check out the palace. We gotta find out what's behind that swirling mist. It may be no bigger than a dust bunny now, but I bet you still got a lot of fight in you. Oof. Oh, you're heavier now. <laughs> Well, time's a-wasting. There's something you need to know first. This is like a brand new world, right? I'm here to help you when you really need it. For example, you see that chest wrapped up in chains? Guide me over to it, I'll pop on over and snatch whatever's inside. Oop. That's what I'm talking about. Nothing stands in the way of me trusty sword Denkomaru. Listen up, we don't want you getting any funny ideas. I may be one meat and sucker, but don't go launching me at monsters. I mean, I might just lose it if you did that. You'd have to clean up me bloody aftermath. Now that everything's clear, let's get going. You know what? That actually sounds like really, really awesome to me. Here, can I can I launch you with this guy's toe? That was close. Better watch out. You're no bigger than a dust bunny now. Now, the, now you know what I have to deal with. Knew there was something fishy about this place. All right. Here we go, another dungeon. He's also a thief class party member. Oh boy, the treats are gonna be massive. That's right, Ami. Find yourself a dog treat, you'll be eaten for weeks. Ah, ha, ah, ha, ah. no, no. That's what they call a blocking spider. Those nasty buggers just won't let you by sometimes. They normally leave you alone, but they can be unpredictable. Just watch their moves. Better safe than sorry. I don't like. I don't like. Why'd you have to call attention to it? Uh, it's got a face on it. Well, I, I also cannot go this way because of this asshole, so I'm going to have to. <laughs> Whoop. 
Whoa, why'd you hit your ride? Tired of walking or something? Big guy here doesn't seem to mind, so knock yourself out. He doesn't seem to be walking either, so it doesn't matter. Hey, what's that? Sounds like someone's crying. Is that a jail cell? Someone's in there. I can't tell who she is. She's got her back turned. They usually turn out to be ugly when they turn around anyway. Plus, we don't want to attract any attention if she raises a fuss. Forget about her. Let's keep going. God damn it, Isun. You are not... You're not a good guy. Like, at all. I mean, I'll use it to thie I'll use you to thieve things. You're not a good guy. No, no, I will not give the spider a hug. He does not want to love me. Spiders are uh, incapable of anything even kind of approaching human emotions. They're insects. They're, they're, they're not insects, they're bugs. They're arachnids. They exist only to kill, and they, they are literally killing machines. Their legs work like hydraulics. So this is an Electro one. Cool, so that worked. And then I cut you, and then I bomb you again. And then you die. Oh, I, for I forgot to pee on him. Damn. Oh, I forgot to throw Isun at him, damn. Also, why does he have a chain coming out of his butt? Like, that's an actual chain. That is a dead bug. Uh. Don't come down, don't come down, don't come down, don't come down! Ah! Okay. Such natural walking. Okay, so I could go in here. I'm gonna go in here. Seems like a little easy to miss spot. Bam. I too wiggle my toes every time I move my foot. It's an unconscious thing, really. Who's running the broom? Oh god, he's trying to crush me. Okay, so I found out where this thing is, and the broom is absolutely just moving to block my progress. Whoops, that's not good, that's not good. That's, that's very not good. Oh, come on. Come on, there we go, yeah. And kaboom. Golden Peach fills the Astral Pouch immediately. Okay, cool. So that's all filled up again, which means I can go back to getting sweet monies. And now I gotta get back past these stupid blocking spiders. Or maybe they'll only come down to, like, block me getting back to a space that I don't need to be anymore. That'd be awesome. Somebody there? Hmm? Are you mallet bearers? It's hard to see from here. Mallet bearers? What the heck are you talking about? Oh, who are you? 
Uh, just a couple of passers, boy. Are you that girl we heard crying before? Sounded kind of fake if you ask me. Isun! You're not some no good monster trying to trick us, are you? What? No, at least I don't think so. I came to Seon City to sell some of my grandfather's bamboo ware. The emperor who lives in his palace had me arrested. Your grandfather's bamboo ware? Is your gramps that Mr. Bamboo back in Kusa Village? You know my grandfather? He raised me back in Kusa. My name is Kaguya. I figured he'd be Kaguya. Not sure what's going on with that blue thing at the top right now, but Moonlight Beauty Kaguya. And I'm afraid that's about all I can tell you. I don't know why I've been imprisoned here. I don't even know who I really am or where I originally came from. Another babe, huh? Oh. Well, Ami's with you this time. How could Mr. Bamboo have such a cute granddaughter? Well, you just sit tight, honey pie. We'll get you out. The great Isun's gonna straighten out that mean old emperor. Then I'll come back and set you free. No, I, um... Don't sweat it, sweetie. You just sit tight. We're gonna search every nook and cranny of this palace. And I'm gonna give that emperor a piece of my mind when we find him. So don't you worry your pretty little head. My partner may not look like much now, but uh, <clears throat> Furball here is actually the great Amaterasu. Just sit back, relax, we got it covered. Let's go, Ami. Get off of me. I never actually said you could ride me, you know. You have to use the peach as an item? Oh, okay. Oh, I've got three of them. Jesus. Anytime I use them, I should just use use it immediately because it'll let me keep getting money from foods. Oh, more dead bugs. Oh, not dead bugs, carapaces. Just like, you know, the things uh, that bugs leave behind when they shed their skin. Bug skins. And kaboom! Whee! Jackpot. Why would the Emperor hide his treasure here? I could smell it a mile away. No thanks. No thanks on the on the creepy sp spiders. That's what they call a platform spider. You see, they just go back and forth like that all day. They're basically harmless unless you stay on their backs too long. Some of them don't like it and may end up throwing you off. Or they might end up flipping and just up and killing you. Uh, I don't like their faces, don't like their faces, don't like their faces, gonna get off. Oh boy, big clover. And 20 praise for that one, hell yeah. Can I cut these? I can, hmm, okay. So they just close up again. Still, it's it's a source of some kind of valuables and treasures and maybe foods. So from the bottom. Okay, so I need to get to the bottom and bust that. And then probably come back up. Yeah, right. I'm going to have to come up to get out eventually. So down we go. Kaboom. <clears throat> if the internet's taught me anything, it's that there's a lot of people who want to ride Ami. Not like this, okay? Not like this. Okay, that's not true. There are a lot of people who want to ride Ami. 
But like in it it's what I know you're insinuating is when she takes human form. <laughs> spider Vader, Spider Vader. Is that considered treasure? Oh, great. Uh-oh, that's a blocking spider. Wonder why it got so bent out of shape all of a sudden. Now we're gonna have a heck of a time getting out of here. Stupid spider. Don't do anything you regret. These nasty little buggers just love to get in the way. They won't bother us as long as we leave them alone. What buggers? You mean the blocking spider? Because he's definitely bothering us by getting in our way. Check out the flask. Why would this be considered treasure? Well, we won't know until we get it down here. I'm not sure if there's a way that I can get up. Might just have to cut the thing from the ground. There we go. Boop. And in we go. So I'm kind of walking on the water right now, which, you know, is cool. Makes me wonder why I can't do this shit normally. I mean, there's a strange mist in this flask, too, but it's somehow different from the mist outside. It feels kind of comforting. Okay. So what of it? Better hide a flask here. Might be this mist bottled up here that he's hiding. Oh, you want me to blow it out? Okay, there we go. Oh, wow, you're getting good at that one. Almost too good. I don't know why the Emperor hid this flask here. He shouldn't be hogging such comfort and mist all to himself. He is an Emperor. Aristocrats tend to do that. <gasps> hey, it's that starlight again. What's it doing here? Shut up, soon. The gods are talking. Oh, it's been so long since we met one of you guys. Whoops. Whoops. Oh! Oh, okay, I've been putting it on the ones that don't need it. Gotcha. There we go. Just forget all those shooting stars that I just created that have their own gravity and will fuck up other cosmos. That sheep is drunk. That sheep is drunk. <laughs> A.F. <laughs> I know how to fix this. I know how to fix this. It's more booze. Oh, we're gonna matrix flip over these banjos. By which I mean every one of them's gonna fucking hit me in the face and bomb. Ugh. Hey, what's up? My name's my name's Bob. I mean, it's it's Kus Kusaga, Kus Kusagami, Kus. You see, this this why this why I just chose to go by Bob. Harsh and Vols is good and to us all. After separations, I took to wandering the corners of the earth. I figured, you know, what better time to go on a massive bender. For long, I was still away here by a sinister power. <laughs> Your rival's broken that seal. Now I, Babagami, 
I'm gonna say that you, you, you can, you can totally miss, bro. You can, you can miss. I'll let you use my mist. Just make sure you bring it back when you're done with it, okay? Listen all over the creations. Okay, you know how this goes, right? I gotta stick this big old thing right up your bum. Here it comes. Oh! That's weird. That's weird. Everything else has been blades and spiky things, which are their own kind of pain, but this is the first time it's ever been something quite so large and bulbous. That's why the Emperor hid this flask like it was treasure. Kusagami, the god of the mist, was trapped inside. Say Kusagami can wrap the world in a thick mist that slows down time for all things. It really did feel like it was in a dream world with no sense of time. But enough of that! That's one awesome power you just got back. If the legend's true, that brush technique can slow down any monster with a single stroke. Let's try out that new power of yours right away. There we go. Just draw the mark that's there on the flask. That'll show the pesky spider who's boss. Boop boop. What the? A blocking spider slowed down. That really is Kusagami's leg. I'm sorry, Bob's legendary time slowing technique. Pack quite an arsenal. We'll slow down anything in our way. I figured out something else too. The Emperor must have a screw loose or something. Why would he possibly want to trap Bob in there? I bet it has everything to do with the squirrel and mist out there. And boop! Eat dick, spider. Not mine though. You keep those fangs away from Mr. PP. Pee Wait, if I win? Wait. No, so he is wind. Let me try this, why not? Okay, so slowing down time will be a thing for some of these guys. At least it's easy to do. then. Cool, cool. Cut up some more Akerns. Get some more Munzies and Foodsies. Let's see what's at the top of these mushrooms. That spider was having none of it. Oh, it's another clover. Okay. Awesome. Dig, 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 dig. And can I knock it in there? Can I send Isun at it? Bam. Steel fist socket. I didn't even remember this power existed. Me too. It, it's not one of the more memorable ones, I think. It definitely gets its uses, but yeah, it's something about it didn't really stand out. There's a clover over there. Gonna get that clover! Oh god. This is a surprise. So, why have you come to see? Desmo, thanks for the host, buddy. How's it going tonight? We just got the power to slow down time. And I've got so much praise in me right now. So much praise, it's bursting from the seams. I gotta use it. Gotta use that praise. Can't get more ink pots right now. I could get another astral pouch. Why not? I can't get another astral pouch. I'm so close, but I can't. Then I'll keep saving. I do want to spend on the astral pouch next. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I ruined everything. And up we go. Season's changing and my face feels like a balloon. I'm dying and in pain. I think you've got, what is that, allergies? I'm sorry, man. 
You rang? I what? Did did I ring? Hi Shawnee, how's it going? <laughs> oh, you also have these problems, right? I'm sorry. <laughs> I realize that. Now oh, god, the spiders. All oh, the spiders. I hate them. You stay up there, spider. No! Keep me away from those fangs. No, you're not God, Shawnee. I'm God. I'm playing as Amaterasu. <laughs> you get away from there, broom. You can't stop me, broom. You too, other broom. It's gonna sneak right by here. Shish ya. Shish ya. Go get that for me, beef boy. Hey, load that up so that I can walk across it. That's unfortunate and gross. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, I made it, yay. <clears throat> I'm okay with the red platform spiders. They seem to be nice. Look over there. Isn't that the Emperor? I'd heard he was sick in bed, but I never expected him to be the source of this funky mist. Even when we overheard those guards that said he was the source of this funky mist. How are we gonna straighten out this royal oaf? We're still too big to fit in the screen. All right, go, soon. Hey, he does actually kind of fight them. Okay, so <clears throat> I know a bomb kind of works on one of them. Can I just slow him down? Guys, please, please die. Okay, so that does not the floral finisher for the yellow one. I know it is for the green because I already did it once. Ow. Or maybe it's not. Maybe I accidentally killed him. Whoops. I keep forgetting to pee on people. God damn it. I have the power of pee. You would not be fine with a car-sized spider. No, you would not, Nitro. Nobody would be that good. Nobody wants spiders that big. They made a movie about it. They were bad. Eight-legged freaks. Da, 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 da. They've used Volks. They used Volkswagens as the bodies. No, no thanks. No. I don't want car-sized spiders. No. That is bad. It is very bad. Also, this dude still has like pretty sizable spiders just hanging out, 
doing like back and forths in his room. The thousand spider-sized horses. Horses are fine, all right? Just don't give me big spiders. Nobody wants big spiders. Nobody. Nobody. You can say you do. You're lying. I know you are. You give me some fangs. That didn't work. That didn't work. I need you to slow down. So that I can pee on you. Pee. 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 I got a demon fang out of it. I'm happy. Just keep peeing. <laughs> oh god. Oh, I'm, I'm close to death again. Not good. Oh, I have a reflector on. Why aren't I using that? God damn it. I could have been blocking so much of this damage. There's an enemy here that you can never find again? Really? Is it is it the the thunder or the uh, wind wheel? Or is it that you just have to, like, fight a bunch of stuff until, uh, sort of secret one comes up? What if someone made a game where you play as a spider? I wouldn't want it. No thanks. I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to sympathize with spiders. Only Spider-Men, as in Spider-Man, not people that are also spiders. Is this the right way or, oh God, oh God. I feel like if I go the other way, I'll find a secret. Uh. Okay, so Imperial Palace map, awesome. Keeping up that wonderful habit of giving me the map once I've already finished the dungeon. Used to play League. Spiders roll Peter Parker and ugh, no. Okay, yeah, so so this is as far as I needed to go this way. For some secrets. I really don't like these guys. Ugh, these big blocking spiders. They make me unhappy. Okay, that's good, that's good, that side's clear. That's a web, okay, that's all good. I need to sneak through these assholes. Whew, okay, good, yay. Right over top of the horrible evilness. He is purple. Check it out, Amy, the Emperor's directly below us. It's like the Royal Mouth's Oaf is just Royal Oaf's mouth is just begging us to dive on in. Really, Isun? This is what you want me to do? You want me to dive into his face, into his mouth? 
this might be a thing that you enjoy doing on weekends, but this is not usual for me. Hideous. You're one fearless wolf. This should be the fastest way to get to the root of the problem. What's the funky looking thing? Oh, I know, it's the dangly thing that hangs down the back of your throat. But if we tickled it, this royal oaf would sneeze. That's our best bet for getting out of here, but let's save that for later. We're going the other way now. His hat is a boat. <laughs> you got bones to snack on? Might need one soon. No, I have a full astral pouch. I'll be fine. To the pooper. We're gonna go all the way through his body. Eastern has one idea for getting out of here, but I have quite another. <laughs> Let's not. Let's actually not. I wonder what's in there. I have a feeling we're in for trouble. You're not gonna turn back now, are you, Ami? No way. Let's go do it. Good answer. You know the drill. Leap before you think. <laughs> Hatched alien. Burst out right through the chest. See, it, uh, it full healed me anyways as I came into here. I'm alright. Also, how am I not dying? This, this fog, like, is killing people outside and I am at the source of it. Look at how thick it is in the air. Whoops. How thick it is in the air. <laughs> is that a tiny sword? Insane. That mist. It's alive, Ami. Oh, there are many swords. Da -da. Further more control this further bridge evil mist over the city. For you, Mert, you dare tell too clear the skies of my person which in battle with me inside a human body will be no easy task. Even now, gold nail, the mighty sword cries up for your blood. Come, step forward, said it, I do not have all my cuts. What are you saying? I can't, I cannot understand you. You don't have a mouth or a throat or vocal cords and you're making this really... Really, guttural sound? I'll step forward, all right. You're a real piece of work, Blight. Better say your prayers. You won't call to this. I'm going to fight the Lord. We are in for the very bad of the river. If we fight here, his body will not. Give me a break. A little action here will help him wake up. And also, who the fuck cares about the life of an emperor? <laughs> I'll just find a new one. Never mind that. You're the one behind that poison mist. Possessing a human body may be an elaborate trick, but it ends now. <sighs> With my supreme blade, Dinkamaru, I, the magnificent Isun, shall rend that hunk of junk you call a bunk. I mean, a bum. Shit. No, Ami, mean, let go of mine. All right, here we go, boss fight. I don't remember this guy at all either. Whoops, okay, you're a fast fucker. Uh, wind? Can I blow the mist out? Nope, I'm guessing that I have to time slow him as that's the power that I got. Oh, I think I specifically have to do it when he's about to do this. So that I can see him moving. There we go. It 
see if I can charge this thing up. Yeah, I, I like can't hold a charge while I'm doing uh, while I'm doing brush strokes. This weapon just sucks. I can't use the glaives. I'm, I made it through the whole game while ignoring them the first time. I just I, I don't think it's gonna work because I'm on the Wii. Gonna have to go back to my uh, to my lovely life beads. Oh, so it's just a body that the sword is possessing. Oh fuck! I should have seen that coming. I was waiting for a more obvious tell. Oops. Okay, so that's not the right time. One of the swords is also glowing, which I know has to mean something. Too. You gotta pee on a boss if you get the chance. Wait. There we go. Nope. You stop. You stop moving. Come back here. Come back here. Okay. Okay. So I can knock it out of there during that and get some more free shots. Can I not cut it now? Damn it, I kept missing uh, missing my chance to. Or like, not doing the input right. So even a bomb didn't do a lot, but I guess that's fair. He is a boss. Nope. Will not get a chance to do that. I mean, he did get a chance to do that, which is a little bit unfortunate, but now we're going to cut you out. Bam. Bigger bomb. That bomb just, like, doesn't do anything. Cutting. Cutting. Weirdly enough, does the most damage. You wouldn't think cutting a sword would work too well, considering it's a sword. They're kind of made to be clashed against each other. But all right. I need, like, a chance to get some of my ink back. Got him. Crazy demon sword chopped in half. My favorite thing, new beads. 
Divine Instrument, Exorcism Beads. Purifying Rosary that contains the power of Holy Light. And also farts. Light, a disease residing within the Emperor's body and born of the intense hatred and evil of the cursed sword, Goldnail, was the source of the acrid mist that had plagued the capital city scenery. But even a creature so despicable and full of hatred was no match for our intrepid heroes, Amaterasu and Isu. Light's defeat brought with it a lifting of the acrid fog. The Emperor, now freed of evil's influence, returned to normal. Amaterasu and the others had earned a brief moment of respite. How did the Emperor get him in his body, though? Like, how, how did he just swallow a terribly evil sword? Evil conspired to cut our tranquil scenes short. From Goldnail's defeated form rose the familiar blackness. The spirit of evil and hatred that had resided within the sword. Black as midnight and deep as the sea rose slowly skyward. Make no mistake, this was undoubtedly one of the foul spirits that dispersed from Orochi's broken body. Quickly and steadily it rose. Then it shot off toward the distant sea and over the horizon. It moved with purpose as if to rendezvous with a lost friend. Because evil just loves to catch up with its, with its best buddies over a beer. Amaterasu and the others had no time to rest if they were truly to restore the capital to its normal routine, they still had to deal with the threat of the water dragon. This tale is far from over. Hey you, aren't you forgetting something? Who are you, who are you talking to? You had it coming big time, gas bag. You aren't even in the same league as the Magnificent Isun, and mostly Amaterasu, but I'm gonna claim credit. How about one of the victory howls? Oh wait, I almost forgot. That babe Kaguya is still locked up. Well, we can't have that. It is not a victory until all the babes have been released. Seems Pops is still snoozing away. How about we just take control and make him unlock her cell? Why bother with waking him up to explain everything anyway? Let's just hijack his brain. Cut up a few cards until, you know, he short circuits. You don't get it, do you? Watch and learn. You're just gonna make him puke? How's that gonna unlock the... Unlock the cell? I'll start up his stomach like this, and then... What the yikes! Yeah, I, y this isn't... This isn't gonna make him unlock the cage, he soon. Are you okay? Looks like we managed to make the Emperor stand up. We gotta get this royal oaf moving. Let's get him over to where they're holding Kageya. So he absolutely is just like hijacking his brainwaves. Controlling humans' business is harder than it looks. We gotta get a big shot over to Kaguya's cell, not this way. Your Highness, you're well enough to walk around. The Kaguya girl was in prison, but she's done no wrong, so I can't understand why. Not that I'm doubting your beautiful wisdom, Your Highness. <laughs> He doesn't seem too well. I know we've already refused the order. Surely it would be wise to seek treatment. Nope, I'm good. Never mind. Never mind. We're, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Are you the Emperor? But if you're here, does that mean those two are... Oh dear, it's all my fault. You killed them. You chopped them up and used them as... Ah! Dressing for your salad, hello, Westerford. I come to see you controlling a humping emperor or something. That's what I am indeed doing, Westerford. Thank you for the resub. You got yourself a boop. <laughs> How shall I ever apologize? Let's see. How about you start off by making me a hundred dumplings? <laughs> Just pulling your leg, sweetie. The voice. That's right, I'm amplifying it through his nostrils or something. Don't worry about it. You think we buy the farm that easy? The Emperor was being controlled by a nasty stomach virus, so, you know, we killed that and figured, why don't we just take over? Not I've always wanted to run a country. We took care of it. Things should get back to normal soon. 
Now, let's make this royal oaf open your cell. Let's see here. Done. Oh, thanks. Thought I'd uh, never get out of there. No time for chit chat, bamboo girl. We freed the Emperor from that monster controlling him, but things are still a bit dicey around here. We're gonna hightail it out of this place. I suggest you do the same. Now let's see here. Oh yeah, coochie coochie coo. <gasps> Weird how we got bigger without that mallet, but alright. That'll make it feel like we've set things straight here. I mean, we've already freed the bamboo girl. Now give one of those victory howls to wake up the emperor. <laughs> Wonderful. Scenesing makes me big. That's weird. You need to you need to put a space in it. Quote, space 265. Would you like to save? Of course. There you go. <laughs> I wondered what is wrong with me. If I had people say I took to my bed with an illness, but I don't recall. I still remember meeting with a bamboo seller called Kaguya. And I remember a secret treasure for crossing a sea of fire. But I've totally lost my memory of what happened after that. It's almost like I was possessed. Talk about a troublesome emperor. Kage is safe and all. Guess we can cut him some slack. I have an uncanny feeling I had a dream about you two. I must apologize to the queen. Imiko? Yeah, that's it. The city's a complete mess and Queen Imiko's not doing a thing about it. There's no excuse for her just sitting around the palace. The lovely white wolf. I seemed to feel so relaxed when you were around. Oh, I know you're from the inside, believe me. That's weird. Collecting demon fangs. If you happen to you, you can have some of my treasure. I'm certain some good will come of it. Ah, I can trade with the Emperor for demon fangs. Fog pot. Allows transfer between origin mirrors. I need 80 of them for the teleportation. Yikes. And the ink, the golden ink pot increases ink restoration speed. Connecting Isun to an enemy to steal items for the thief's glove. I need a lot more demon fangs. Like a lot more. Yowzers. Gotta pee on everyone. It's endless amounts of pee. Whoop! He's missed things. Oh yeah, yeah, you has missed some things, Westerford. You've missed you've missed some grand old things. <laughs> Okami's been fun. This is our new ruler, the Emperor. He's the existing ruler. He's not really new. I'm trying to figure out what else there is I can do in this little area here. I can dig up this. So that's just a pearl for some more muns. Some ink pots. Hmm. Okay, so the way down is the way out. Maybe. Yeah, there there is a, a little bit of extra stuff to explore in here. Not a ton. I don't seem to be able to get inside his sleeping quarters, unfortunately. Nor can I get into where Kaguya was being held. But okay. This place is... Where is this located? It, oh, right! This is this place. All right, so I already left that. The, yeah, this, this is where I was supposed to... Hey, Kaguya! Hey, Bamboo Girl! What are you doing spacing out here? I mean, you're free now. You can go anywhere you want. Oh, hello, you two. I hardly recognize you. You were so tiny when we first met. You certainly cut a dashing figure at full size. 
You think so? Well, actually, I hear stuff like that all the time. I think I'm full size now. Wait until we find the reverse mallet. I, I meant you too, Isun, yeah. Anyway, the city's a dangerous place right now. You should head back to your grandpappy. Then Emperor Fella's got an eye for that treasure of yours, right? You should get away before the others start stiffing around. Plus, he seems awfully lonely. Really? Oh, I see. Dear old man thinks of me as his own granddaughter. I would really like to return, but... <coughs> You're not? You're not his granddaughter? You mean the real family lives somewhere else? You should go see him if you feel that way. I know nothing of my past. I don't even know who I am or where I came from. My first memory is of waking up in a bamboo grove. The bamboo cutter took me home where I was cared for. To repay his kindness, I helped him with his bamboo wear. That's the case. Then why don't you hurry up and go see him? I know nothing of my past. Let me just keep talking about things that aren't related to that creepy old man. Don't make me go back to him. I do recall one faint memory. I thought long and hard while I was in prison. It was then that I remember being in a small dark room long ago. That's all I can think about, and I felt I must get there. It's back to the small dark room as soon as I can. So that's a little weird. That's a pretty weird story. I mean, you don't even know where it is you want to go back to. Bits and pieces are coming back in flashes. Together they form a vision. I see a royal crest inscribed in earth amid a grove of bamboo. I must go to Sasa Sanctuary. There it shall all become clear. All right, so I gotta get back there too then. Let's go in India. I mean, first with the dark room. Now you suddenly want to go to Sasa Sanctuary? I don't know where I must return, but I have this intense feeling. It drives me forward. It drives me to seek the royal crest. I must leave for Sasa Sanctuary at once. Bye. Bamboo girl, wait. Oh, damn it, she's gone. She couldn't have been moving more than, I don't know, two miles per hour, and yet she's gone. Forever. We'll never find her again. She told us where she was going and she was walking very slow, but she's disappeared from this earth. What a pity. Maybe I did miss some. Look, look, guys, what does it matter if I miss things? I don't need all the things. As long as I have, you know, just some of the things, then I'm happy. Oh, you, oh, West missed things. Okay, now I gotcha. Get some more praise. Huh, did not realize this was kicking around here. Uh, another Infinity Stone. Probably just gonna try to sell. Oh yeah! Now that the mist is gone, I can actually bloom things. Yay! It, there's gonna be a lot of blooming that goes on for a while, and most of it's gonna give me like almost nothing. But overall, it'll add up to something good, like 50 or whatever. There's a lot of trees in this town. And it will look so much prettier when I'm done. Get rid of all this black deadness and bring back life and pink petals. Plus, as long as I make them, like, big enough, it should... Oh, right, and I actually have to get them all for Mr. Flower, because that's another side quest that exists here. So that's going to take some time and some digging to find all of them. So much nature blooming going on. No, not not wind. Not wind. Bloom. Yay. Yeah, so those aren't dead trees, so I don't know if I have to bloom them the same way as I would one of the cherry blossom trees. I'll try it, but I don't think it's going to work. Oh my god, it does. So I have to hit up all of them, too, even though the non-dead ones do not give me praise. They just sort of turn into regular trees. 
Oh, they already were regular trees. They just bloom. That's it. I was very concerned that it wasn't going to maintain its cherry blossoms because I could have sworn I did this one already. Hmm. Okay, so that's a lot of cherry blossoms. Where else will there be trees hidden at? Oh, you can blow the leaves off? Shit, didn't know you could do that. Yeah, that's true. Seon City is absolutely chock full of side quests. There's a ton to do here. Queen Amigo's bodyguard, she's in her palace praying. I'm under orders not to let anyone disturb her. So we can't get in there. Weird that a queen is higher than the emperor. I thought in Japanese culture or like old, J old Japan stuff, the emperor was always the highest. Didn't want the sun, but okay. Cool. More of those. Any more back here? There are always more, okay? Oh, there's also an old man back here. Oh no, it's you! It's Fisherman! Hothead, what you up to here? finally realized how empty the life of a sword collector is. Now I'm hooked on the thrill of fishing. Will you not join me? Nah. I suppose you two need to rest and to continue being assholes somewhere else. When a dude shares his passion with you, it's polite to at least feign interest. God damn it. Okay, so there's a mermaid pool all the way back here. Come on. Solid circle, there we go. Dig, dig, dig. Got us a clover for even more praise. The queen is plot important. You can sell the fish for, he catches for extra money if you need it. I don't think I need cash right now. I'm actually in a pretty good spot. I'm just gonna come back over here and make sure that these trees that I had didn't accidentally get blown off again. Yep, they appear to be okay. Whole keys, whole keys. Um, well, I've been going for two hours, and it is 11 o'clock. I don't know, I'm what, like, Okami's been running long streams for a while, just because I always get into it. But this kind of seems like it might be a good spot to end this stream. What do you guys think? Before I get too involved into the side quests of Seon City? Of which there are so many. Hey, chest. Like, I could say it would take a stream or two to do them all, but I actually think it's going to be more like we're never really going to be finished with Seon City until we're done the game. Because there's just, we're just going to be so many little things to do. <laughs> All right, so then let me finish up uh, looking around this aristocrat area for trees, and then I'll call it a done deal. I'll head back to the save uh, outside in the main city, save there, and then uh, next week we can just start up from there and take a look around the rejuvenated Seon City. I'm fairly certain that Rao isn't telling us everything, either. Have you noticed that the mist over the city suddenly disappeared? There must have been some change in the Emperor. We'll take credit for that, thank you very much. Hey, wait. What about you? Why didn't you try to help him? Couldn't your mystical powers have located the source of that mist? I knew it, you and Himiko were up to no good. That was my mistake. I'm just a priestess, you know. I can't go snooping around the Imperial Palace for no reason. 
you cleared out the mist, then I offer my congratulations. So then, now that it's resolved, on to the next problem. All of what you've done so far is amazing. However, the water dragon is a much bigger problem. No trading ships can get through. The city's food is running low. And the evil besieging our fair land seems looms large in the shadows. Now is exactly the time we need them. If only we had the fox rods. I'll continue looking for the foxy rods in between the blooming of the trees, all right? No, I didn't want to come back in here. Just just had just had to make sure you weren't you weren't going to disappear on me. Little missy. What about my rods? No, we will worry about the rods later. And boop. yeah, my eyes hurt. I need. I think I need to get to bed like considerably early tonight. I have been just in a uh a decreasing slump for like a week. Sweet, the carrot zone vanished along with that funky mist. Looks like the city's gonna come back to life. Bet you never saw a happening place like this a hundred years ago. This must be exciting for you, being from the country and all. Now, I know you don't just want... I know you just want to have fun, but don't go overboard. I mean, I don't want you to forget what you're supposed to be doing. That's Isun's hint that there's a million side quests here. And I'm going to take that as straight-up endorsement to go ahead and forget what it was I was doing. That's, that's a sun. That's another sun. Can I not... Can I not bloom these? Do I have to just burn them? Hmm. Interesting. So many trees. <laughs> it's going to take a while to be. Hey, I got two and one with that one. Those trees aren't dead. Gotcha. Okay. Well, let's spend what we got real quick. Because now I can afford the Astral Pouch. I don't really need it, but I don't need most of what's in here. I'm kind of just picking this that I can spend a bunch. Drop down a save. Hit that button. <laughs> Someone actually gets my spoofs and goofs. Tiny Seven Cat, thank you for the follow. I hope you enjoy Okami, and I hope you like Fire Emblem too, because that's what's happening on two out of my three streams a week right now. Playing some Fire Emblem Fades. I have to get that fire over to the torches. Oh, I just realized what that's for. All right, we'll worry about that next time. For now, I don't. I don't have a raid message. I don't even know who's going. I'm so pooped. Running right now. Nah, I think I'm okay. Yeah, I, 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 I do this from time to time. I just call it not raid anybody. Cause like, I, I don't know. I, I it, it, would, it would be easier if I had like a message ready to go, but hunting for a message like ends up taking some time and just sort of kills the momentum at the end of the stream. <sighs> so like, I mean, Golden Fury is pretty good, but yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm so damn dead. I wouldn't even have the energy to go hunting for somebody or to like explain what's going on and then, and then, and go we're just gonna call it here guys <sighs> you all you all are strong independent women you don't need no raid to figure out where to go for more entertainment i'll catch you all on thursday for some more fire emblem fates where there will be more promotions yay we're in the back half of the game now bye bye